hello friends welcome to this session uh, in this session we will uh, particularly look for the open ssl commands for uh, generating ec uh, keys so we will take the couple of example for the open ssl commands how we can generate the ec keys and uh, let's start so let me take one uh, example here so first we will check the open ssl uh, is working or not so let's see okay my open ssl is working let's see the version for the open ssl so i am having the 11d uh, which is the 10 september 2019 so since we are on the latest version so we are okay with the open ssl so now the first command we will going to see which is the uh, the list of supported curves for the currently open ssl so here we will take uh, the command is open ssl ec param so ec param basically used for the uh, ec keys and here we will take the list curves so list curve will basically show you the list of supported curves for this particular open ssl so this sec p is the uh, supported curves this prime this is sec you can see the brain pool curve also here so this is the different curves id which having the different uh, configuration of ec keys okay so since this command is used for uh, finding the uh, all supported curves let's move for the further how we can generate the ec keys for the particular curve so for that we'll take the same open ssl ec param so now what we have to do we have to do the generate of key gen key which curve you have to use so here we will give the name and curve you can select from here the curve name so i'm just selecting the brain pool 512 so brain pool 512 now no out and the my uh, private key name So if you see here, I just created the private key. Uh, let me remove the all files here. Okay, now I don't have any keys. Now let's create the private key again. So we have created the private.p so this is the naming issue let me just uh, remove again the okay now it's a pam now let's see the proper so private.pam has been created it's a private key now the first question is we got the private key but still i need a public key so normally how we getting the public key we will extracting the public key from the our private key so for ec key how we can extracting the public key let's see so command is open ssl here we will use the ec and in in i will give them my private key and now i want to out what i need out it's a public out so here i take the option pub out and here i am giving the name is the public dot pen so uh, we made a, some mistake so open ssl ec in the private key okay so here we have to make the out for the specific public key right now you, you can see the it's a reading of ec key then it's writing the ec key so first you read the public private key then it's written a ec key that's a public key let's see here so you can see here the public key and private key let me just clear this one let's see the private key content 
so this is my private key let's see the public key content so this is my public key so you can see this begin with the private key here it's end with private key and this is the basically specific ec key same as the public key and the end public key now the best use case for the ec key is the sign verify so how we can do the sign verify let's see uh, first we'll do one touch one file with the test name okay and let's add some this is sample file okay so so we have the test file now i want to do the sign and verify for particular file so how do i sign verify so we will use the same open ssl so here we will use the dgst which sha you want to use so here i'm taking the example of the sha1 and the sign for you will use the sign command and we are signing the with the which private key so the private key passing and which file i want to sign okay so i'm just giving this test now here it will generate the signature file so i'm just creating the signature file for particular signing so you can see here so sig.bin has been created now i want to verify the same process with the public key so let's take the same example here i'm just updating the sign with verify okay now i'm verifying with the public key and here we don't want to take a out but verifying using the which file so signature file we are verifying and which file we want to verify so test so you can see here uh, can only sign and verify files okay we have made the small open ssl dgst sha1 verify public.pem okay so since we have to pass the signature using the specific uh, tag here it's a sig file but how it validate the open ssl we have to pass this is the signature file okay so once we pass the proper signature file it will validate this signature file using this file so this file is okay verified okay you can see here so this is the basically process how we can create the ec key how we can create the private key how we can extract public key from the private key and how we uh, do the sign verify operation uh, we will pass all these command line in the same video content you can find this command line help